Good evening, friendos. It's time for Quest for Semi-Glory Thursday night. Shmup Book Club. We're hitting up one of the uh, five-year anniversary SBC shmups here. This is Axel A for the Super Nintendo. One of my personal favorites of that era, actually. It's quite nice. Um, let's get connected up to the club. Looks like we're the first ones here, despite starting late. That's okay. We'll see who else joins. Um, I've got a beat. Looks like 1.15 million. Almost two loops, so we'll see what we can do about that. I am actually going to make sure these are changed up appropriately as well. Um, uh, shot, missile, uh, the rest is fine there, I think. Okay, I'm going to turn up the brightness too. This did seem a little bit dim before. I wonder if that was why. Okay, let's go. Good evening. Not bad, not bad. Uh, Axel Day. Attempt to get the two loop and improve my score. Probably not going to happen, but one can always hope. Hmm. Uh, kind of why I haven't gone to do it because it like, would feel uh, bad about not getting more than one loop. <laughs> It's definitely not a short game to loop either. It's a good chunk no. of time just getting it, but yeah. But on the other hand, if I don't do it, I'm not going. It's not going to happen. So <laughs> right. Yes. Yeah. Cross so that it's barrier. Kind of, yeah. So it's kind of a can't win either way. Set button here. There it is. Arms installation is complete. Good luck. So, what are you working on then, Zaki? If not excellent, uh, I'm gonna. Uh, I'm going to do one last. Uh, Try it, uh, Seri Senshi's friggin'. Push it a little bit further, huh? Yeah, push it a little bit further. I don't think it's gonna happen, but again, the might as well do one last ditch effort at it and right, then right, right. try and push myself to get to uh, Axley Gate of Thunder. We're the last bit of the month. Oh, Gate of Thunder. I should probably try that one again. One of those ones where. I'll do fine once I'm de-rusted on it. Right. Until yeah. that happens. I mean, I guess it's the same thing for Axley, although... Oh. For Axley, I'm, I'm not sure exactly what the hitboxes in Stage 5 are. <laughs> and this is actually connected. Okay. Yeah, you're, you're here. We, we got you. Well, I might be able to tell you about the hitbox in, st in stage five if I get past stage one. Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> oh boy, yeah, because you're playing Axelay. Mm -hmm, yes. Mm -hmm. I, 
Stage 5 seems fine until it's not. Yeah, I've just never been sure about those hitboxes. Everything else is like fairly, seems fairly clear, but Stage 5 just puzzles. I mean, Stage 3 is just as nerve wracking to me in spots. Stage, stage yeah, 5. Like... Yeah. I was gonna say, stage 5, there's just more crap moving around actively. Well, that's true, too. Oh, stage 3, that's... I'm less worried about, though. Stop. Stage 3, I don't have any issues with. Even stage 3, the pipes always make me nervous. Yes, Stage oh, 3... Yeah, yeah. yeah, Stage 3, if I have problems, I always feel like that's my own fault. <laughs> I feel like I'm, I, I, I'm able to understand at least how to avoid the pipes. I have a vague understanding of it. Um, I think the thing in stage 3 that might get me is the fire from the background. Yeah, that always messes with me the most. I can never but quite I, tell when it's about to hit me. I'm not sure if it's just when it's completely extended that the hitbox is there or something else. That's what it always seemed like, but I could never judge it properly. I played Sari Century Spriggan, so I forgot how I did everything. Get all power ups. Do not do a die. That's about it. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> I have a particular weapon that I like to stick with. And then beyond that. I just bomb to get rid of mm -hmm, stuff. Mm -hmm. This might be a case where I will have to bomb. Uh, crap. Okay. Yeah, I'm still not at the point of necessarily picking up every possible pickup, because... I don't even trust myself to get back to stage 5 at this point, because I died on <laughs> stage 4 yesterday. Or not yesterday, two days ago. Shit. Oh, look at oh. Would have been nice if I was able to sight read to the end by accident like EI, but I think that we were both doing it. Uh, you know, sometimes you just do a sight read, and that's how it be. Oh, I missed that green. I wanted that, but couldn't get there in time. I completely forgot how... I got to the particular weapon set that I wanted. Oh, I'm wondering which one you use, because I'm almost always the blue plus green combination. Um, crap, what's not gonna help? Uh, I use blue-yellow. Is that the one with the rotating one around you all the time? Uh, no. How did I establish oh, this? This one's interesting. I don't know if I like it, though. Uh, blue yellow is like it's um it's you, you know like the blue green shot that kind of um twirls its way up the uh, yeah that's what I usually use green mm -hmm. it's like the same uh spray as that except it goes like straight um, oh and right it's, like on either it's on it's either like side of the you. the split one yes exactly yeah yes and then like oh, good damage output. Oh yeah, that's why I use it because it crushes things, and it's enough so that you can go back and you can wave, kind of wave back and forth, <laughs> and uh, really wreck some things. 
I mean, I like the blue green because it seems to crush things. Oh god damn it! I forgot that the holiday uh, Christmas machine guns are on the sides <laughs> at that point. I think the reason that I don't like the blue green too much is Pirate. just the res it's just a result because it kind of spins its way up and you have to wait to fire it yeah, again. Yeah, seems yeah. pretty slow. Whereas, but, yeah. whereas, yeah, the yellow and too. blue is pretty steady. I guess I'll have to give that another look. Also, thanks, always... for the, thanks for the good luck, and and we're not shmup, we're not shooting potatoes. I am the potato. That's why we're shmupping <laughs> potatoes. I got like three hours of sleep Tuesday into Wednesday. I slept fine last night, but I still feel the effects of that. Oh, was this how I did it? Was it that it just kept unloading bombs or something? Maybe. But then I keep ending up with. Oh no! What it was was. Oh, oh I think what it was was I just. Ah, oh, that's not gonna help. This will deal with this as is. Oh. I never see when these guys shoot because, like, the background is just all oh, going absolutely nuts. On the waterfall already? Yeah, not even the waterfall, just the <laughs> bushes before, but then you get the mages that, like, wait a second mm -hmm, before they mm -hmm. shoot, and I always think the second is longer than it is. I always think the most amusing part of the, uh, the, the, I guess I can call this the spindly doodle shot, the, uh, green blue, is, um, the fact that enemies that are in a set formation will actually just drive themselves into it. Ah, yes, now the extremely distracting Ow. waterfall section. Oh, good. This almost warrants a photosensitivity warning, actually. Uh,. Numerous things in this game that warrant for <laughs> sensitivity warnings. Now that I think about it, and I accidentally picked up something I didn't want. Oh, cool! Yeah, we're 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 reversing each other with the same shot, except that they take more shots to die than I do. I mean, yeah, I wouldn't want to make it too easy. And now me. I'm actually just like the worst possible loadout. Can I? Can you shoot that? Thanks. Cool. All right, now we've got the even lower rate of fire version of this. All right, now we're back. <laughs> Goody. <laughs> Yeah, because if you only have one green and one blue, mm -hmm. then you only get to shoot two at once. Whereas it's four at once if you, uh... If you have the three. I can't believe I weaved into that incorrectly. Alright, come on, we gotta get the, the Chain Chomp boys out of here. Change on boy, get out of here.
Oh, jeez. Well, I'm, I'm stuck here now. <laughs> That's probably not a good idea. Oh, well, that sucks. Now do I have no bullets for the boss? No, no weapon for the boss, rather. Whoops. Oh. I'm just gonna move. stay over here and hope they don't bother me. It's interesting how even your neutral shot actually kills those relatively quickly. Oh, what the hell? How does that have a hitbox? Oh, what? I didn't hitbox. The dudes on the the ground. I always forget they have a hitbox. Oh yeah. It's so annoying. Yeah. Come on, destroy it, thank you. Oh, oh no, okay, I guess I'm going this way. Traded a hit. What? What you are guessing are oh. remasters from the first three Strikers 1945 games? What? What did you buy it on? Are we talking Xbox One or or series or whatever? Excuse me. What? How did I only pick up one of those? Are you fucking serious? Cool. Dying in ways that I never considered possible in the beginning of stage three. This is not the formation I want because this rotating thing does no damage to half the enemies in this stage for some stupid reason. I think it's just all the ground enemies. Uh, I don't consider the jellyfish to be ground enemies. <laughs> oh, it doesn't? Oh, okay. Oh my god, I'm just getting hit by everything. I guess... The, rot the rotating around you blue thing does not seem to damage them. Yeah, I know it does bullets, and I think it does popcorn enemies, but... Does it not go through walls? It's still damage shit within the wall. At least some weapons. Not but entirely some weapons. sure, though. I mean, what? again, if the enemies can't, can't be damaged to it from, from, from oh, the yeah, beginning. Oh, I guess, then. I suppose. It seems I'm, weird. I am not even going to get up to the fucking worms at this rate. I'm just dying from everything else. Alright, so we're just going to practice the stage now, because what the fuck. I forget if it does damage the spiders, but, hmm. I wonder if I can survive long enough to get the uh, formation that Zaki was talking about. Yeah, okay, so, like, the, the dual forward blue shot does damage things. I kind of feel like this is a liability in this stage, though. Because uh, that does not, that does not go through walls. It kind of depends on the situation, I guess. I just use it every- I use it oh, everywhere, so I've kind of got it routed out to how to do things on specific spots. The uh, yellow and green seems to work okay enough. The yellow that and green is the, hurt things. the one that I stick with. Ah, oh, damn it. I was not looking at whatever hit me there. <clears throat> Can't hit through walls with this. It actually, wait, the one on the right seems to be going through the wall. The one on the left does not, so I don't know how you explain that one. With yellow and green? Mm. Yeah. Yeah, those kind of, they... they spawn in, and if they hit something, great. If they don't, they hit the wall and disappear. <laughs> kind of weird. I just think... It definitely seems like the yellow, ha like the, the yellow shots in the middle have the way higher DPS, though. 
Yeah, that's for sure. Oh, I just picked something up that I didn't want. Yeah, the yellow shots are the strongest bit of that. So now I apparently now I'm Captain Six Way for some reason. Oh, that one. It's not terrible, but I feel like it lacks. Old I, I guess it has decent power. But I think the only reason I feel like it lacks power is because I'm so used to um. What do you call it? Oh, but I can shoot backwards so I can hit the worms with it, but I mean, if it doesn't kill them, then it doesn't really matter. Yeah. Arms installation is complete. That's the big problem, I guess. <laughs> Oops. Okay, well, I killed that one eventually. I just... With what I... I guess if you were sticking with any other combination... Well, I guess it depends on the combination. If you stick with, like, a three-color combination, I guess you'd be ditching less... I'll be ditching less power ups. I, I guess. Yeah. I don't guess. know. Whoops. I never found like the three maybe, different color ones not. to be all that good though. Yeah. There's some. Where am like... I supposed to go? Come on. They're okay, but they're not fantastic. Yeah, they're not great. Oops. Which direction does this guy come from now? They are coming from both directions. Okay. I remember that happening once, but then I also remember expecting it to happen and it not happening some other time, so I'm very confused. Yeah, this brown and green doesn't do too bad at, uh, at killing these things, if you can get a decent shot on them. Are we back to rocks again? Yup. Don't know how that didn't hit me. Yeah, I, I kind of don't like the, uh, what was it, the blue-yellow, just because it, it's too focused. It leaves too much in my front wide open. Oops, I might want a different weapon here, but I don't know. Oh, okay. That cycled off the brown. That actually works. is not what I want. Although it might it might work here if these enemies die fast enough, which they seem to. Mostly. Yeah, for that section that one isn't that that isn't is actually pretty can be pretty useful. And now it's time for... hey, this isn't Blaster Master. I mean, I guess part of why I like the, uh... Like the blue-yellow is that when there are things that fire that. straight at me... Well, actually, that works, I guess. Something was going to hit me eventually.
All right, that's the face that wanders off to the Toyota clearance event. I forgot. I guess I'm no, glad I got that bomb, bomb before because I got hit again. And now it's the uh, the the seagulls from Finding Nemo phase. Mine, 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 <laughs> mine. <clears throat> Shot through the heart, and you're to blame. <laughs> you give schmubs a bad name. Ah, that phase, yes. Launch this? I just launched that, I think. That's how I did that. Also, I didn't realize you actually can shoot the last frog, but I don't mm -hmm. think it matters. It gets you a couple points. Not Is many. It worth 30 ish? Maybe? Yeah, 30 maybe. I am 15, never ready knows. for when this guy launches his freaking crystals at me. Like, it, he just sits there for like 20 minutes, flaunting his crystals. Well. And then he finally shoots them, and I'm never ready. Kill him before he does it, so then you don't have to worry about it. I mean, that would be great if that were possible. It is. I um, never have enough firepower no? to do it, seemingly. Oh. The only thing I've been able to really do that with is the blue yellow, <laughs> unfortunately. Yeah, the double forward yellow manages it fairly. The double forward yellow can too? Yeah, fairly yeah. consistently. Sometimes it doesn't. Uh, where are my fucking shields? Like, seriously. All right, time to practice that stage. Oh. Wait, did I should launch that as a bomb. Oh, this is fine then, I guess. Okay, yeah, I just did it with blue green, so apparently it is possible. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. I pr it probably helps to be like right up on us so that you're not wasting time waiting for your shots yeah. to be able to fire yeah, again. That's true. That sounds about right. Whoops, that was dumb. Just get that then. That's a lot of bullets, dudes. Yeah, I'm gonna use the screen clear there. Oh, but all the points. I mean, half of the things on the screen were bullets, <laughs> so. Oh, okay. I think there were more bullets than things worth points. There are actually some nice points where you can get a shield power up on screen and no bullets at all. Yeah, I know. I Like, I try to have as minimal things on as possible, although oh. half the time what ends up happening is something is barely getting on screen and that blows up. I think the, I think the problem is just, like, losing shield at an inconvenient time, so that means you just have to pick one up again mm -hmm, mm -hmm. for survival's sake. And then sometimes I'll do it just to clear off the screen if I'm in a oh, difficult situation. Yeah, I'll say that with the blue and yellow, I have to do a lot of waving on the screen. <laughs> back and forth, back and forth. Well, at this point, I'm going to shit so I can get my weapons back. Because I like how these guys just stand around until they're like almost at the bottom of the screen, then they get up and do shit. <laughs> That's like me today, I'm like, screw it, I need to sleep till 11. Okay, that guy gets to live, I guess. Uh... Oh, I guess I'm not getting that power up yet. I still didn't get the power up, I got hit though. Oh, you got something. <laughs> Thank you.
Oh, I didn't mean to get that, but, uh, this is actually interesting. I'll dink my ass. last phase with nothing. Uh, please back up. <laughs> Oop. Not ganked anyway. Oh, I am definitely not prepared for this guy this time. Uh, oh! Oh! oh shit. <laughs> that didn't hit me? Alright, cool. He gets to live because this gun is not good for damage at all. This is bad. Uh. Please back up. <laughs> oh, what the hell is it? Oof, this uh. formation is not good. Like every non useful weapon formation. Arms installation is complete. Good luck. Oh, stage four. What are you again? I don't oh, remember wait. what this boss does. Giant oh, missiles. right. The oversized missiles. How could I forget? Actually, this formation could work for this. Just gotta keep an eye on the top of the screen. Oh, there's other dudes. Hi, what are you doing here? Oh, that is not what I wanted. You know what? I'm just gonna bomb that, yeah. Oh, right, and the shots that look like the all clears but aren't. My ship and go off screen, please. Thank you. Oh, well, he's dead, so alright, that works. I remember eating a lot more shit on that last time than I did this time. The score doesn't count though because I've been safe state practicing. Oh crap! Ah, dude, get off my ship! Go away. All right, now this this stage I've never gotten past freaking Garland. Yeah, that that stage I don't like at all. My least favorite stage. It feels like it should be in D Force, and you should be able to change elevation. Huh. Oh, does wait, this shot actually goes over that. Okay. Oh, but you still oh you can only oh. hit him after he throws his axes, okay. Yes. But last time I was stuck here with a weapon that couldn't even shoot over these walls. Oh, okay, so it can't be destroyed until after he throws the axes. Or until he's off the walls, I guess. I don't know, you I could never figure okay it out. Here, given that I can't freaking reach half the things that I'm trying to shoot at. Oh, is that what it is? You kill him when he's trying to jump off or something? Yeah, yeah. So otherwise I think everything hits the wall and it just That's doesn't do didn't nothing. hit me? Okay. I won't, I won't, uh, question that. Oh, shit. Well. Ugh. Oops, what am I doing? Ah. I'm making it past the first stage. Oh, that destroys those things? Alright, that was convenient. You know what? I oh, the marble tunnels? Left. Yeah, I got, a, I got an all clear one. Uh, we had the four of them. Oh, I like how, because the green shots go behind you first, if you're right behind a wall, it, uh, oh, God damn it. it eats all of the shots. Uh, 
Ah, uh, yeah, I figured. I'm not sure how you're supposed to not eat shit in that situation. I guess that works. What? Oh, yeah. All right. I forgot how robust mimics are. They are quite beefy. Too much so, honestly. I like how that bomb didn't do anything to it because it hadn't woken up yet. Oh well, I'm here for Garland, and I have like the worst possible loadout. Yeah, mimics are annoying. That mid boss is annoying. Really much in I that state. I mean, the, that's good. The first part is okay, but once he gets into the wider lightning shots, I'm like, I don't know what you expect me to do with this. I know how to dodge some patterns, but he generally just doesn't do the pattern that I'm. Once he gets into the second phase, is usually when I get into trouble. Yeah, like the first pattern is fairly easy, but then the second phase is just. Also, now I have like no firepower. Oh, and he just shot me with those. Oh, and that was game over. Whoops. Yeah. Honk. <laughs> So I don't know how EI bullshitted his way through this. It's... Well, the, well, also, he makes that really annoying noise, too. Uh, wait, what? this is my stage 4 save, isn't it? Well, we can, we can challenge the crystal jerk again. He, he fired one after he died, what? <laughs> See? Oh! That rock. Oh.
Okay, there's barely a warning where the crystals stop moving, and that's when he launches them. Yeah. I don't know whether it's consistent, but the first one stopped at the top right. at you, but I mean, like, where it stops before it moves. Oh, so. okay, yeah. Uh, I, I, find I don't know whether that's consistent or not. I always find it a pain to avoid it. Let's try to, uh, not need to avoid it. Mm -hmm. All right. Oh, crap! Really? What <sighs> ass. Oh, man. There's one right there, huh? <laughs> Wait, why did I lose two weapons there? Fuck you, man. Oh, crap. Okay, we got him anyway. Good. Alright, so stage four, I'm a little less worried about. Stage five, I'm still very worried about. Oh, sir. Jeez. I mean, originally I wasn't worried about stage four because I sight read it without a problem the first time, but then Tuesday I completely ate shit on it and. Oh, and I did again, so. Fuck. I'm not gonna some shit right there so I can get my shit back. There we go. I like how I, I managed to have my shots overlapping the axe guy right as he launched his stuff and just everything exploded in one spot at once. It just kind of looked like a really big <laughs> sneeze. <laughs> that hit nothing of what I had hoped it would hit. Oh, I hit a bowling ball. Well, and I can't pick up my thing because it's in the middle of territory that I can't get into. Cool. Honk. Oh, shit, that's right. Uh, why are, wait, why are some of these things green and some of them are purple? They seem to do the same stuff, so I don't actually know if there's meaning to that. Alright, dude, back up so I can get through the door. Oh, no, you followed. Jackass. All right, can't follow me through that door, idiot. I never know how to get through. There's always like this in this. There's this gap between bowling balls that is smaller than your hitbox. Oh, fuck. So like, I guess I'm just fucked if I end up between that. Nope. So like, don't even get to Garland because the bowling balls are also assholes. Oh, you fuck. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, that was interesting. Wow, I really tried to get hit by that. Uh, but yeah, I actually managed to kill one of those axe guys as he jumped on rather than after. Interesting. That's helpful. 
I mean, I don't know that I would ever be able to do it consistently, but it's Ooh, apparently possible. Rather fast before they get onto that wall there. Oh, whoops. I'm accidentally all green. Wait, why am why, if I'm all green, why are my shots yellow? Because then they explode into bullets. I guess. Yep. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, no, that's true. Our is complete. Good luck. That was dumb. Hey, I got another one while I was jumping in. Okay. That one barely even got to appear on screen. And those before that becomes a problem. Mimic time. Uh, it's the worst kind of time. Yeah, I think the one thing I'd say about yellow and blue in that area is that it does make it really hard to deal with those. You know what? I should actually drop a separate state here so that I can actually practice Garland. I don't think I've ever been able to pick out any rhyme or reason to his patterns in the second phase. Well, he always seems to shoot the guided shot, like, as the lasers retract. Well, I do know the end of it. I mean, the laser... the guided shots aren't that much of a problem. It's, right, it's the lasers. It's the lasers that make it a problem to kind of get around those. But what? Where'd that one come from? Hey, I actually survived him this time. Okay. Oh, and, uh, sorry. Suddenly there's no floor. Say where the PlayStation <laughs> 2 boot up logo. What's going on? Oh, don't worry. It's just a very. Oh, I have to. Did I have to go up into there, or does she just go after like 20 seconds or something? No, that's the end of the level. No, it's just she wasn't doing anything, and then I tried moving up, and then she did, but I don't know if it was just timing. Perfectly scripted. <laughs> I don't have any clue. Uh, these rocks sure make noises. Yeah! Oh yeah, they are the noisiest of the bunch. That is... Ugh. It's not great. That's what I have to say about that. <laughs> It's so loud, too. Uh, it's just like a constantly... It's, it's because it's like constantly in contact. It's just like mm -hmm. you can't actually mm -hmm. hurt these. So. Uh, I'm sure if I had well, a different weapon that well, doesn't you, constantly well, be in contact, it would be not as bad. You can you destroy them. Damaging them. Yeah, they really? just take a whole heck of a lot. Oh, yeah, because the only way I'm actually destroying them is with bombs. Or, or rather, with uh, clears. It's, it's also not worthwhile because they give you shit for points. Yeah, they, I figured yeah, these are one thing I would not have any remorse for. They give you a, any points at all? I thought they gave you nothing. No, they give you no points. It's just the, a matter of free doesn't give you any points. Clearing them out so you can kill the shit that does give you points. Well, I mean, unfortunately, worry. this weapon doesn't care about needing to clear them out. But yeah, I think mm -hmm. like for me, I'm always using a weapon that kind of goes through it. So right, yeah. I don't have to worry too much, but. If you're using a weapon that doesn't go through, then yeah, you definitely want to clear it out just so you don't get hit by it. Mm -hmm. There is one spot in there where a screen clear will do it for you as well, nothing else. 
I guess kind of the nice part about that is... Um... Wait, all of them just exploded on their own now. Oh, because they need to make room for whatever the Megazord is here. He's charging his laser. Oh, God. Oh, God. Yeah, look the... out. Oops, I just launched the wrong thing. Whoa, I was almost in the way of that laser. All worked anyway, I guess. I keep almost being in the way of the laser. Jesus Christ. Okay, uh, well, I destroyed one arm right before the head, and I think the other one technically survived. Wait, how can you release a zero-wing re-release that fixes the English mistranslations? No, then it's that's no longer part of it. Wing? Wait, what? Like, that's a cultural icon. You can't touch that. Where, Ooh. What was that? When was that? I don't know. I mean, I know there was, like, the, the arcade... Uh, arcade ports, I mean, ports of the arcade, um... Arcade Zero Wing and a few other, a couple other Chopin games on Steam. Uh, but from what I heard, they're really bad ports. And that they don't run at proper frame rates. And gross. That they're based off of prototype ROMs. Also gross. What the wow. hell? How, poss how wrong can you possibly do it? They lose the source code or something, so they had to patch it no whatever idea. they had. <laughs> wow, this stage is very busy. That, that they, they did not... But yeah, I initially had them on my wish list, and when I saw all that, I was like, okay, nope. Can I, going to spend my money on oh, her. Okay. It's kind of disappointing, because, like, Outzone, which is one of them, is, is a good, is a fun game. The other one was uh, Zero Wing, which otherwise would have been kind of nice, but... Yeah, oh well. Eh. It would be hard to find good arcade. Uh, there are a lot of lasers pointed at me. Oh boy. Alright, well, at least I got my shield right back. Oops. Yeah, this weapon works pretty well here, though. Missiles finally hit me. Stage six isn't really that bad. There's a, there's, a, there's like a handful of things you want to need to be aware of, but otherwise you can mostly just sight read it. And now I seem to be losing in Hollywood Square, so I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's, oh, that's that. the two minute cutscene. Just pause it briefly and unpause and skip the damn thing. I, I don't do that because you can not, you actually get power-ups that come in during Oh, that. do you? Oh, interesting. Yeah, That's hilarious. It's like, oh. alright, look, while this guy is busy rattling his ass off, uh, I'm not, here, have I'm not free patient yeah, enough like for that. Three, it's like three or four thousand points. Hot damn. I didn't know that. Oh well. Yeah, here's the first one. Oh, that's so dumb. <laughs> it's like, hey, want, want some popcorn? That'll be 17 bucks. Oh, that's really stupid. Yeah, I know. It, it sucks because I don't enjoy sitting through that, but yeah, it's like, right? oh, that's an, it's a, such a an easy, lazy 4,000 points that I just have to do it. 
Uh, it's the worst. Oh well. I can't believe they would just slap a two minute <laughs> dialogue soliloquy in here. Uh, this is stupid. Arms installation is complete. Good luck. It's like if you're gonna do that, at least like have a flashback with it or something. Right? You don't get you're not allowed to talk this long and not really do anything. I'm sure it's important lore. If you could understand it, but Kind of the rough, though. No, I it's, guess. it's just 1990. It's just 1991 copy pasta. <laughs> oh no! Why would you do that? It, it, it just like sounds like a lecture. It really like, does. That's the tone yeah. it feels like. Like he's got no inflection to his voice or anything. He doesn't get angry. Yeah. Oh come on. Like, I'm just gonna say a whole bunch of things at you, and then things are going to happen after that, and whatever. This is well, he's, he, he doesn't have Twitter yet, it wasn't invented back then, so he's got a reply guy somewhere. This is the history of our conflict that in the absolute most boring way possible. Oh, and we, we, uh, we interrupt this soliloquy for a psychedelic background, holy shit. Please tell me I don't have to look at the- oh god, I have to look at this forever- oh god! <laughs> Photosensitivity warning. Also, that was a laser that had no fucking warning whatsoever. Yeah, that has warning for like 0.2 seconds. Oh, yeah. Good luck. Yeah, okay. I'm oh. done with this game. Oh, jeez. Yeah, I remember that part now. Ugh. Like, how are you supposed to see that coming? First of all, the entire screen is already flashing bright oh, pastel right. colors, yeah, and then you have guy. to look for the specific circle of bright yeah, pastel watch, colors watch that you for have the, for like 0. 0.2 seconds. The spark. <laughs> yep. Like, yeah, all right. Yeah, I, have yeah. no, I have no interest in 1C seeing this game now, so that's that solves that problem. Uh, let's yeah, go play something else. Kind of bad. Uh, I had no luck with Escaluda on Tuesday. Let's go have more no luck with it tonight, probably. I mean, or for a change of pace, you could have some luck with it. I mean, that would be nice, but... I'm not gonna, you know, if I'm gonna jinx myself, I'm gonna do it in the opposite direction, not the direction I actually want. That's a fair... I... yeah, I guess I can't argue with that. I mean, plus, if you don't think it's going to happen, you can't be disappointed. Right? Yeah. You know, right. You manage expectations. And then if it does happen, you can be extremely excited about it. Be like, hell yeah. It's not, it's it. not self-deprecation, it's the reverse whammy. <laughs> oh, I need to capture the correct window, though. I almost forgot to do that last time, too. Hmm. Like, I don't know if forgot to take off my startup screen earlier. <laughs> Oops. It's like I'm gonna follow up uh, 150 hours of Persona with 150 hours of accidentally leaving the startup screen on. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Just to balance it out. Also, yeah. this game is a lot louder, actually. I mean, I like the like, music and stuff. But... That was like a grand total of probably of like nearly 400 hours of Persona 5. Oh, yeah, definitely over 300. Oh shit! Oops. Well, I tried to out DPS him before he uh, dropped crystals, and I failed. No. Oh. <clears throat> yeah, I was point blanking him. That didn't end well. <laughs> no, those crystals uh, do not like that. Yeah, this is this is true. All right, let's do that. Also, let's remember I don't have a shield right now. Oh, nice job. Take that auto bomb since I had to switch tabs on something. 
Alright, it goes a lot faster when you got weapons. Dumb. I don't really want that auto bomb. All right, so that score is garbage, but yeah, first run of the night, whatever. Okay. Uh. Yeah, they, the, the, uh, things have a surprising amount of blood in, in Escaluda. Oh yeah, they are a little juicy, aren't they? Oh, what? Did that too late. Oh. That was a little weird. Uh, I thought I could. I didn't have any bomb left, I guess. all my gems there. It took that freaking long to die, but I was closer to the end on it than I, I was. Oh, 
Oh, that was fucking dumb. Arms installation is complete. Good luck. I don't know how that didn't hit me, but okay, cool. Thank you for the host or raid, whoever that was. I'll have a look in a sec. Hey, Ricky, thanks for the raid. I think I missed another message above that, too. I will have to catch up on. Oh, whoops. Well, <laughs> did not leave that correctly. Uh, okay, these guys, right? Or you after Ricky? <laughs> oh! <laughs> Like me, I'm just gonna squeeze my butt on through there. <laughs> hey, Flag. Oops, that's a bad idea. Ah, uh, dumb. dashed right into a bullet there. Uh, and also there. I can't pause this, therefore I will have to catch up with chat. Good, we got that extend. Yeah, this is a cave shmup, this is hectic. <laughs> oh, that was dumb. I need to learn to freaking bomb like that. Mm -hmm. Except that was a really Sorry. stupid place to bomb. Oh no, he's gonna do that. Oh no, shit. Uh, oh, I always, oh like, no. My, my <laughs> instinct is to panic swap to Kakase mode and hope for an auto-bomb, but that's exactly the opposite of what I should be doing. If I need to bomb, I should bomb. But you may end up not having needed to have bombed. And that's no good. Yeah, I suppose. That that has happened, like, <laughs> I don't know, I, I I don't think swapping gives you a vulnerability in this, but sometimes it feels like <laughs> I've done the Assault Android Cactus right. swap dodge yeah. thing. Sure oh, well, the... there's the end of that credit. All right, Just let me all catch mind. up. It, oh, more id-based mapping, okay. <laughs> Pyro was here and it's rookies. Okay. I, uh, I watched some of, uh, some of Jimmy, uh, Jimmy Squared, James Paddock, whichever, whichever oh, you know, <laughs> uh, oh, play through the end of his playthrough of Alkaline 1.2. He had the same exact problems I had with some doors never opening 
in Jusley's map, but Jusley was actually in chat, so he saw it, so he knows uh, that it's a thing. Now, Jimmy was playing on QSS, not on VK Quake, so it's not VK Quake, Quake specific. It is likely, like even Mazu was there and was saying, it's it's likely just an alkaline, or rather a uh, yeah, like an, a mod interaction problem. No, fuck! <laughs> no! Uh, I didn't, I didn't even pay attention to what my score was there, actually. But I'm assuming it was not a PB since it didn't even make it through the third boss. Although that, that now that I think about it, my last PB was at the third boss, but I doubt I got that many points because the last time I looked, I wasn't even at seven mil. But yeah, so this is Escaluda. This is a cave shmup from 2003, either 2003 or 2001. Uh, it has it has neat music. I was tr I was trying out the PS2 version on Tuesday as well. Oh wow! I, yeah, I'm resetting. Oh, um, oh come on, really? The music is clearer on the PS2 version, but it also feels mixed differently. Come on! And some, the way it's mixed it's actually sick. makes the third stage music worse. Iron Well 0.7 is happening? Wow. I was thinking that I might switch to Iron Well this weekend regardless because uh, I tried updating uh, VK Quake, but now that has a mouse and menus that you can't turn off, which <laughs> is bad. Uh, well, it's not as bad as Iron Wells because it seems like it has some kind of like sort of dead zone implemented where like it won't trigger a menu change until you move it like 12 pixels or something um whereas iron whale you would just like accidentally be pointing at a different save file that you didn't want to save over oh well oops which is why i stopped using iron whale but the new version has a way to turn off mouse and menus so it's funny because like 0 0.6 added mouse and menus and then people asked to be able to turn it off and I don't understand why VK Quake would, like, almost a full year, well, maybe not a full year later, but like half a year later, repeat the same exact transgression. Oh. Okay, I used way too much. Oh, all right. I used Kakuse way too much on that right arm, left arm, whatever. It's left, my right. Stage left. And like I looked at the commit in VK Quake that added their mouse and menu support, and they did not add a way to turn it off, as far as I can tell. But yeah, like I'll, I'll have to I'll have to see whether Dump mentions that particular part of the update because to me that's the most important part of the update. Aside from the fact that 0 0.6, oh, 0 0.4, 0 0.5, and 0 0.6 I think all happened in the course of like a month or two, and then 0 0.7 didn't happen for like a year. Even though the commit to disable mouse and menus happened, like, a couple of weeks after 0 0.6 or something. I am not paying oh, attention at all. Let me try paying attention. Uh, no. Missiles, why? <laughs> Crap. This is gonna happen. Oh, oh those dudes shooting in the background. Please go away. Oh. Ah! <laughs> Damn it. Hey, dude, stop. Oh no. Okay, here. I have a couple of missiles for my own. Thank you. Twenty-seven K short. Bonk. Oh well. Yeah, that's gonna be a first. That's ninety percent <laughs> of a turtle. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, I guess it is. Yeah, you're not wrong. 
Oh shit! Ah, well, I don't know what I got hit by there. Whoops. Oh. Um. No. Oh, Captain Clapper. No. Get out of here. The right weapon to I, deal with. Oh, you. I almost veered right into that one bullet. Uh, Not really paying oh, any mind. My God. Oh no! Oh no, I'm done. No weapons. That's no good. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm still not paying attention. Fucking. Alright, whatever. I'm I out. guess we're just gonna not do that route. Well, I only have eight of these. I might as well still do it. Shit. Now I'm gonna be behind the eight ball on it anyway, though. Oh, right. Rocks. Rocks and shit. Yep. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh, I think uh, that's going to... Ooh, that score is awful. ...do it for my attempts on anything tonight, so... Did I'm surprised they lasted till 10 o'clock. Oh! Ah, lasers. <laughs> I mean, I may not have been super productive, but... Um... Although I was productive enough uh. to determine that I'm not interested in trying Spriggan anymore, because that last boss is absolute nonsense. Yeah, it kind of is. Not the greatest, but, yeah. Well, I mean, that's... The last boss is nonsense, too. <laughs> the actual last boss. Yeah. The last, last boss. Oh, right. Okay. Um, fuck. <sighs> oh, good luck on the rest of your attempts. <laughs> All right, Thanks. see ya. Head out. Take it easy. Yep, see you later. Oh, yeah, there's no way I'm passing this on no weapons. Nope, there I go. <laughs> uh, damn it. Fuck you, Axel. Wait, how did I... I, mu I destroyed that right as I swapped or something and didn't get the cancels? Bleh. All right. I'm going to hang it up there as well. All right. Not enough time to try another playthrough of this. Yeah, right. <laughs> Talk to you later, Kenny. See you later. All right, that'll do it for tonight. We gave it a solid go. We couldn't even loop once, so whatever. That's how it be sometimes. That'll do it for tonight. Um, let's see. This is podcast week, so next stream will be tomorrow night, 7 p.m. CDT. That's right, CDT, because we're in daylight savings. Uh, Twitch.tv slash Zero Productions. We talk about video game news, what we've been playing. We do some design at the end. Off on Saturday, and then Sunday, 7 p.m. CDT. Uh, more long play, so more Dead Cells. Castlevania DLC. Very exciting. All right, that'll do it for tonight. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye. <laughs>